Hi, and welcome to another tooling video. In this tooling video, we'll discuss the S-curve. This curve represents the technological life cycle of products. Sometimes a product is on the top of the pyramid and is the cash cow of your company. It is then, and maybe especially then, that you might need to redesign your product or design another one in order for your company to keep being competitive. When we look at the graph, the technology is moving from the infancy stage to the expansion stage, and finally, the maturity stage. This can be explained by the way customers act. In the infancy stage, the early adopters, we could call them the nerds, buy the technology because they want to be the first ones to use it and are willing to pay a high amount of money for it. When the product is becoming more mainstream and more affordable, the early majority will buy the technology as well. When the technology moves to the maturity phase, the late majority will buy the technology for a low price. In many cases, the current technology moves into the maturity phase because a new technology emerges. A good example is the music business. At first, there was the LP player. Initially, only the early adopters bought this. When it became more affordable though, more people bought the LP player. During the expansion phase, another technology emerged, which was the cassette tape. The early adopters moved to the cassette tape, and then later, when more people switched to the cassette tape, the LP player became obsolete. Over the years, the same pattern emerged with the switch from the cassette tape to the CD, and more recently, from the CD to MP3 files. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next tooling video.